I heard. And that's part of it. Last night, right from the start, I knew I was bombing. I was big and phony. Real V and thou. And then I started rushing it. I was new in Denmark. I just, I could not connect. I couldn't get a hold of it. And while I'm babbling, I look out in the second row and, and there's this guy, a kid, like 16, obviously dragged there. And he's yawning and wiggling his legs and reading his program. And I just wanted to say, hey kid, I'm with you. I can't stand this either. But I couldn't do that. So I just kept feeling worse and worse, just drowning. And <laughs> I thought to myself, okay, all my questions are answered. I'm not Hamlet. I'm no actor. What the hell am I doing here? And then I get to the soliloquy, the big job. And I'm right in the headlights. And I thought, hell with it. Just do it. To be or not to be. That is the question. Whether it is nobler in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune or to take arms against a sea of trouble. And them. And I kept going, finished the speech. And I look out, and there's the kid. And he's listening. The entire audience. Complete silence, total focus. And I was Hamlet. It only lasted about 10 more seconds and then I was back in hell and I stayed there. But for that one little speech, that one bit, I got it. I had it. Hamlet. And only 8,000 more lines left.